targets annihilated. Vulgar being you as well. A dash in the top. The bullet time connecting. You have to jump something in from team two get smart. Staying as much mm -hmm. as they can. Half HP already on the Ocean Drake though. Will Omega be able to go with the Seed Island Wave? Jumping in here comes Impressive. Looks like that is going to be able oh, wow. to Team Seed can still be able to secure that Dragon. Flash in the main from Trevor. The Hex like Ultimatum being used as well. Stuns are coming in. You have the Heroes and just being used. Hamas is still pretty much alive. Arise caught off guard. A Flash out for the turn, but it's not going to be enough. The kill going over to this Impressive. There is being bursted down as well. A Flash in from Azar. Slice and dice. Another kill going over wow. to the Secret. A double kill for Renekton. Camille being annihilated, and it could be a 4 to 1 in the favor of Team Secret. Maybe 5 to 1, but will not connect. And just like Butter, the Baron will fall in the Team Secret. Okay. Hashtag like Ultimate on it again. Who will be the person to die? That is with the Heroes and just being used as will arise and force to jump back. Rampage going over to Chewie. Impressive with the Zonius. Rampage for Azar as well. And you have Impressive being melted down by the Riven. It's not being sent out. The damage coming out from Team Secret, though. You you have the quickness being used by your face. Flash is still available. Power being sent upward, forced to jump away. Uh -oh. Now you have a knock in, a dash in from Cyber, but still not being able to get a kill. He needs to be going over to the Suri. A flash out from this power. Rampage on Oriana. Toss not connecting. It was a two to none in favor of in favor of Team Secret. Making for no bomb being thrown at it again. Toming in the front line, but Team Secret they were able to stop the seeds from final adversity. They are gonna be starting. Marking this one out, there is a ward right here for Team Secret, so they know that there's this happening, it's gonna be a fight. Azar the front line will be able to use this mate, that will be a good buy for Domek. Well played Team Secret, the, the awareness in the team fight is just flawless at this point, there's a good point, there's a fight at the top. Mega Kernel Bomb, a flash onto Azar, but the final spark will be there to protect the teammate. Azar pretty much safe on their turret. Alfred Hill will connect the stun or he's not going to come through. You Whoa. have the field being secured by Azar. He will have lots of guns in a few more seconds. Easy. Shaw is gonna follow through. That's gonna be the death scene in. Power coming up. That's gonna be the chunk of water. Go for oh, this gold card. Gold card. Flash to follow through. But Hero's entrance zones away Shaw. Woo! That's gonna be good support coming from Hammond. And Shaw's dead. Now Trevor coming into the party. That's gonna be the Vault Breaker going in for the knockoff. That's gonna be the damage for Team Secret. Half HP for Shaw. Tidal Wave goes in for the knockoff as well. Try and save his life, but is not going to go for Final Adversity as Team Secret snap tracking down. Killer Instinct into the backside goes in for the Surge Gauge. Saves Trevor's in life. And Team Secret will get another. Will they get the last 40 A's? Danny trying to run for his life. Team Secret is just jumping all around. Danny's gonna get killed. That's gonna be the A's. Final Adversity takes the Cloud Dragon and Team Secret trades down on tier one. Gotta kill this symbol. Lock down onto Trevor. Chunk the water goal. Put a knock up title way to follow through. That's gonna be a good engage. But Trevor is not gonna be locked in. Slicing Maelstrom goes for the stun. He is gonna fall down. But he's still gonna be alive for a bit longer at seconds remaining. But that will be the one for two teams. She can take the advantage down. Look at Azar into the backside. Goes for the stun. Double kill for Azar. And Rafi will be low HP as teams. She can take the jump. QCFC will get security onto the Mantle Dragon though. Here was Andrew, two man knockoff. Omega Esports goes for this step by step. But UCFC now is down one member up against Omega Esports as they fight 3v4. But Dragon into the backside enables them to get another oh, kill yeah. down. Demon, Demon Kite kiting away. Get another kill. That's gonna be a 3 for 2 Knight, the fight is not gonna be over. Time not gonna be the only one remaining. That's gonna be the ace for UCFC. And here comes Nastro for the charge in. They're not going to be on. able to do so. So that's Elder Drake going into the pockets of Omega Esports. And I guess that's it. Omega Esports, ladies and gentlemen, you asked for a game three. You are going to get yourselves a game number three as Omega Esports charges in for the GG push. Dragon, Demon Kite, and Dampier is going to be spawning here in a bit. But what can they do? That's three champions going up against four. Nexus is going to be taken down. 
Going for the knockoff. Mega Esports gonna get pinned down. GCSC into the backside, but impressive. So tanky. He uses up the ultimate now. Hero Zen trying to go back away for Hero. But Nasjo will fall. That will be the 4v5 now. He's coming through for the rise. That's gonna do flash in. Goes for the dash away. That mark onto Dragon. He is gonna die. He is gonna get a raise. And Demon Kite, 1 HP. He's gonna fall as well. Now it's over. That is not gonna be successful for here. Esports here comes Omega with Sun Zhao and in time lapse doing a lot of damage. Mid turn is gonna go down. Oh, time lapse taking a lot of damage right here. Will be able to get wow. one and take one kill. Shut down on solution. JLC. Take those. Yeah.